Hi, good evening, everybody. It's uh, one minute to go till six o'clock, and um, I've uh, spent the better part of the day collating everyone's question and answers uh, that has come through to me. Just want to state that uh, due to legal compliance, there were a number of questions related to staking, validation, tokenization of assets, uh, yield rewards, and the like. Uh, which is in the process of being um, answered. I will be updating a additional uh, content set tomorrow and during the course of next week that will then provide clarity to uh, those types of questions that have been asked to me. What I've done tonight is similar to yesterday is that I put together a um, pre-recorded uh, content set based on all the questions that everyone has asked related to yesterday's showcase on the comprehensive compensation plan update. That is also being loaded into the back office under the document section. So that's going to be made available. I know we also shared that onto a number of groups um, throughout the network. So just a note, I'm going to be running through a recorded um, session now that has to do with all the questions that have been answered sorry, questions that have been asked over the course of last night and today, most certainly within the Q&A section. Please, if you are not able to hear due to the sound, I know there were some sound issues yesterday, please uh, let me know. Um, uh, yes, uh, sorry, just with regards to uh, the USA market, um, what I just want to let everyone know what we are busy in the process of doing there. I'll certainly put it into the USA groups that we are then loading specific um, uh, product uh, access plans and products that have then don't have then the tokenized assets component to the yield flow product. So just quickly to answer that question, I have covered that in this video and I will make this video available um, through the Google Share. So just to answer that question right away. So without further ado, um, as this is an iterative process, as questions are coming in, I'm doing um, my best to answer them in a legal compliant fashion, and I will then update this video content uh, over the course of tomorrow as well as in during next week as I get more questions of individuals that are asking different questions from the different uh, groups themselves. So I'm going to share my screen now, and uh, I've gone through a list of questions that have been posed to me. Uh, clarification, as you know, this was purely around the compensation plan. I've also looked to cover other questions that individuals had, ambassadors had across the across the network relating to understanding VARA, relating to Star VARA, Battle Royale, relating to Ultra Fair, relating to the Yield Pro component, what validators are, etc. So I've really collated all of those and put that into the next presentation that you're going to see. And this recording is then also going to be made available through the Google Share link that I previously made available with yesterday's compensation plan update. If there are any additional questions that are not covered, please make sure that you send those to your upline. And as noted already, due to uh, legal compliance around tokenized assets and also further um, updates regarding the uh, minting events, updates regarding the tokenomics white paper plans, as well as then um, the yield returns. Um, there are obviously a number of disclaimers, uh, earning disclaimers that I do need to make, which I have made in this presentation and will then certainly then uh, make that available once I have signed off on that content. So. I'm, I'm not necessarily going to be covering all the questions that came through co the course of the day due to the fact that I'm waiting on sign off from legal compliance uh, in that manner. I will then do so during the course of tomorrow as well as then during the course of next week as I then get those answers to all the questions that individuals have been asking. So without further ado, I'm going to share my screen if I may. Please, if you don't mind, if you will just let me know, like yesterday, I did have a technical issue with the um, sound quality. It was in the, exactly the same format as yesterday uh, where I answer all the questions. So I'm playing it right now. 
please let me know if you have any sound issues. <clears throat> Hi there, it's Nick Vandenberg, the CMO of VARA. Thank you for everybody that joined last night's uh, comprehensive update of our incredible updated comprehensive plan. Today we're going to go through all the questions that was posed during the live webinar as well as all questions that I have collated during the course of the day from all the various leadership groups within the VAR Ambassador Program. If I haven't covered any of your questions in this session tonight, please make sure that you write these down and talk to your upline uh, or share them on the support uh, channels within the VAR Ambassador Portal so that we can then update this recording and uh, answer all your questions that you may have. So first and foremost, I felt that I would give you an overview of VARA, the Ambassador Portal, Star VARA Barrel, the Ultra Fair, Fair Gaming product suite, as well as the Yield Pro product. Then I will go into answering the various questions that have been posed. And hopefully, the overview also gives you the ability to be able to understand the product suite from Fusion One and from VARA a little bit more. So what is VARA? VARA is more than only the official sales arm for Fusion One's comprehensive product suite. It is your ticket to the future of blockchain and an unrivaled Bitcoin-based ecosystem. The VARA network presents ambassadors with an opportunity to change the course of their future through promoting and selling Fusion One's product suite. They can then earn through substantial rewards and create exceptional value from the compensation plan as well as yield returns from the various products and services within Fusion One. By becoming an ambassador, you'll be integral to the success of the Fusion One product ecosystem while building out your own organization. You'll also further be engaging with customers, driving sales and reaping the incentive sales rewards for your commitment to promoting Fusion One's immersive innovations. With the updated VARA Ambassador back office, existing assets that were consisting of Star VARA, Ultra Fair, and VARA allocations are now being updated into their respective product offerings. So, as an example, any in game assets related to drop vaults and spaceship skins that you acquired through either Moon Planet or Solar Packs are now listed as inventory in the Star Vara mobile battle roll application. And likewise for any in-game assets pertaining to Ultra Fair and or um, the various other products. So why Vara? As a sales and distribution arm of Fusion One, Vara ambassadors are powerfully positioned to benefit from this massive multi-industry intersection. Fusion One strategically targets key industries to shape its future and unlocking the Bitcoin blockchain ecosystem, which focuses on expanding into fintech, blockchain, gaming, AI, and more, collectively representing a market value surpassing a trillion dollars. By harnessing the power of simple contract language, SCL for short, Fusion One is involved in the foundational infrastructure that will So what is Star Vara and what is Star Vara the Battle Royale? A number of you have already um, gone through the back office and have seen that there's now three products available. You're able to click through to Star Vara Battle Royale, the um, Ultra Fair Fair Gaming Fantasy Sports product. And as we're onboarding customers into Yield Pro, you'll be able to go onboard in yourself into the Yield Pro product. So. You need to prepare yourself for the biggest gaming event of the season. The Star Vara win your share of $1 million worth of Vara tournament is set to debut on the 14th of December 2023. Already available in the Vara Ambassador back office, you do need to acquire any of the new access plans to join this million dollar tournament. As the Ambassador, you get to play and win your share of the million dollars worth of Vara. Star Vara is a cutting-edge battle royale game set in the expanse of space. 
Among the most popular game genres in the world, the Battle Royale has become a major player in the industry, shaping its future in several ways. It's easy to access and easy to learn. Battle Royale games have attracted a new generation of gamers, expanding the gaming market and creating new opportunities for game developers. With ultra-modern, high-fidelity graphics and smooth gameplay, players and ambassadors will find themselves immersed in a visually stunning universe, battling it out for supremacy. And thanks to our proprietary byte streaming technology, you can expect excellent latency and seamless gameplay as you fight across a stunning spacescape with hundreds of other players within the Battle Royale feature. One of the big standout features of the Star Battle Royale is its versatile game modes. So we're catering to a myriad of different player types, whether you prefer to go through the tutorial section, free to play or play to play options, you're able to have relaxed solo open world exploration, or if you want to build a team to gallivant across the galaxy, Star Vara caters to all players. With the Battle Royale mode, the game will launch an esports tournament structure providing competitive arena for those seeking recognition in a global scale. Be prepared to showcase your skills and compete for galactic prize pools in massive interstellar tournaments. So there we have it. That is the upcoming uh, exciting launch of the Star Vara win your share of $1 million worth of Vara tournament. And that culminates off a kickoff on December the 14th, which is really coming up in the next couple of days. So what is Ultra Fair? Ultra Fair is a fee to play fantasy sports uh, environment, and it's now available in the VAR Ambassador back office. Ultra Fair free to play fantasy sports is a multi sports application boasting over 100 sports leagues that's available on iOS, Android, and through the web interface. VAR ambassadors are key players in distributing this exciting product, which boasts easy access and innovative social gaming elements. The twin pillars of UltraFair's philosophy are really what sets us apart. Firstly, a low barrier to entry, which ensures anyone with a passion for sports can participate, fostering global inclusivity, and secondly, cultivating in the social element, which elevates this fantasy sports experience. If you look at UltraFair's integration on several novel strategic elements, as example, these features include boosters and debuffs, which add layers of depth and interaction. Boosters can be used to amplify a user's team performance, while debuffs playfully hinder an opponent's team, creating a sense of camaraderie and playful rivalry. But most importantly, UltraFair thrives on competition and passion acknowledging the perpetual love for sports as a global unifier and a source of excitement for millions. It's not just about playing a game, it's about part of the sports legacy that spans football, cricket and rugby and more. By offering free participation into fantasy contexts across a diverse range of sports and prizes ranging from cash and crypto to appliances, UltraFair is setting a new standard in the world of fantasy sports. So there you have it, everybody. That is an overview of VARA, the ambassador portal, what it means to be an ambassador within the VARA ecosystem, fueling the Fusion One product suite sales, and then further to that, what you can expect from the upcoming Star VARA Battle Royale, win your share of a million dollars worth of VARA tournament, ultra fair as a fantasy sports free to play environment offering an incredible array of sporting experiences. And now finally, the new Yield Pro product. As you'll notice in the back office, you'll see that there is a link through to the Yield Pro product. As ambassadors go through the updated KYC and AML process, we will then be onboarding ambassadors into the new Yield Pro product. This is really essentially where you're able to view and manage your portfolio of stake tokens within the Yield Pro program. As you're activating an access plan or product top up, your respective token allocation portion is being added to the validation staking framework within the Yield Pro product suite. The question pertains to validator rewards. 
SQL validators contribute to the computing resources to processes and host transactions and SCL smart contracts within the Bitcoin network. Since SCL contracts are independent of a native blockchain layer, data and storage are no longer handled by a blockchain and thus rely on network validations. Validations earn VARA, FAIR and DFG token rewards for doing so. Migration to the Yield Pro product for non-restrictive countries will be taking place during the course of tomorrow as ambassadors go through the updated KYC and AML process. Now let's dive deeper into the VARA updated KYC and AML policy. At VARA, we are deeply committed to your safety and integrity of our platform. Over the past few months, we have been diligently working to further bolster user security and ensure compliance within global regulations. We are proud to unveil a refined KYC process and an updated AML KYC policy aimed at safeguarding both our ambassadors and the VARA platform. So here are the KYC requirements for accessing and utilizing the VARA ecosystem. The KYC process is flexible. You now have the freedom to complete the KYC process at your convenience after signing up. It's a three-step process which incorporates the KYC process which comprises of document scanning, proof of residence uploads, and screening questionnaires. You can complete these steps in order that suits you. There's then a KYC status validation. Your KYC status will be considered completed true only when all these three steps are successfully submitted. Any pending orders will then go through the order approval process, and please note that orders including points and asset assignments will only be approved once your KYC stated is verified and completed true. These updated requirements are essential to access the VARA ecosystem, and we greatly appreciate your cooperation as we collectively work towards safeguarding our users and upholding the highest standards of security and compliance on a global scale. Just a note, there's been a question pertaining to restricted countries. I'm going to read these out. They're also going to be made available within the terms and conditions in the VAR Ambassador portal as well as on our other channels. So the portal will, by default, block products per restricted area based on different restrictions. These restriction territories, not inclusive, Antigua, Barbada, Afghanistan, Algeria, Bangladesh, Bolivia, Belarus, Burundi, Burma, Cote d'Ivoire, Crimea, and Sevastopol, China, Cuba, the Democratic Republic of Congo, Ecuador, Iran, Iraq, Liberia, Libya, Macedonia, Mali, Morocco, Nepal, North Korea, Pakistan, Somali, Sudan, Syria, United States of America, Venezuela, Vietnam, Yemen, and Zimbabwe. This pertains to either the tokenization of assets and or other restrictions that might apply. So let me give you an update to our incredible new access plans and product top-ups. In order to gain access, access plans and product top-up products are needed to be activated via the verification of your KYC and agreeing to the AML terms and conditions. These access plans are able to be purchased directly through the VARA back office, where existing ambassadors who are originally on Moon, Planet, Solar, and Founders Packs are also able to purchase the new incredible OnePlus Pro and Pro Max plans. Furthermore, access plans are not upgradable due to the Yield Pro product integration and the allocation of assets between the various asset plan offerings. I will keep you updated if and when we are able to then allow for upgrades to take place on these new products. Product top-ups are for personal consumption, and in order to activate a product top-up, ambassadors need to have an existing access plan activated on their account. Also, product top-ups are limited to the existing access plan that you're on. So as an example, in the previous webinar, I referred to being on a one plan and then having a restriction in the type of product top-up that you're able to purchase. 
please make sure that you look at the extensive comprehensive compensation plan material that is going to be made available in your back office. Just a disclaimer on token prices and allocations which are subjected to change based on allotments and compliance requirements. Each access plan and top-up product is based on an allocation table as a USD allocation component towards the actual number of tokens that you will receive allocated to your Yield Pro product. Let me give you a high-level update on our incredible new compensation plan that I announced to the market in yesterday's webinar. This is really where you can embark on your journey of unparalleled rewards within the VARA's ecosystem, which is our commitment to VAR ambassadors, which goes beyond ordinary and offering a range of benefits that amplify your sales success. We have a number of enhanced incentives, which is really unlocking not only a world of opportunities, but we have included an addition allocation of VP for binary matching, as well as ranking VARA points and direct sales commission. Meaning now you are able to experience rewards that are not just valuable, but tailored to elevate your VARA journey. For detailed insights and exploration, please go and have a look at the comprehensive compensation plan. The power of ranking is critically important within the VARA Ambassador Portal. As you ascend the ranks and unlock a cascade of benefits, the higher you climb the ranks, the more access you gain to exclusive perks, including ascension pulls and the incredible team builders bonuses. Plus also, rank is utilized within the new offering from a subscription revenue perspective. Your journey through the ranks isn't a symbol of prestige, it's a gateway to enhance rewards in unlocking the VARA compensation plan. As already stated, our Ascension pools are made up now of Nova, Aurora, Gamma, Validus, Nebula, and Galaxy. And as you climb the ranks, you're then able to participate into significant monthly payouts based on cumulative sales allocation. Our team builders bonus, I'm going to go into that in a minute. There's been some questions pertaining to how that team builders bonus actually works. I've also updated the compensation plan to include a full example of all the components that factor into the team builders bonus. Let me just go into some detail around the Ascension pools as we've added two new additional pools to the existing four pools over the course of the last year. So the access to the first pool is unlocked once you reach the rank of Lieutenant. And as you keep on climbing the ranks, you'll find yourself in the pools with fewer members, meaning more monthly payouts. At a lieutenant level, you are then unlocking Nova, similar for lieutenant commander. At a normal commander level, you are then in the Aurora pool. At captain, you're in the Aurora pool. Commodore, vice admiral are in the Gamma pool. Admiral of the fleet is in its own pool at Validus. And then senator is in its own pool at Nebula and Chancellor in its own pool at Galaxy. So we've really looked at unlocking additional value with the inclusion of the additional two pools. Just remember, Nebula and Galaxy needs to have one personal sales sponsor per month and requirement to be on the Pro Max and or founder member status to qualify. From a Team Builders bonus perspective, the introduction of our Team Builders bonus is a dedicated bonus system designed to reward strong team building and organizational strength within the VARA community. Each month, 10% of the access pack price and top-up product price minus the EUSD top-up will be allocated to the team builders pool for distribution, specifically to reward users with a commander rank or above. <laughs> team builders bonus participation is based on the calculation of personal sponsorship line earnings, uni level, your rank, and their rank. And this is how it works. The calculation is done on a monthly basis. It starts from the moment a user re achieves commander rank or higher. And the calculation takes into account the user's rank, the ranks of their sponsored team members, and the earnings generated by each member. This initiative underscores the significance of strong team building, organizational size, and leadership within the VARA community, encouraging ambassadors to grow and support their teams for sustained success.
Additionally, I have updated the compensation plan to include the weighting rank factor for each respective rank. So now when you go into the compensation plan and under the team builders bonus section, you can see what effect each rank has on the multiplication of your participation within the team builders bonus structure. Just to announce that there's also a number of earning disclaimers uh, that we need to uh, adhere to from a legal compliance perspective. These are all available to you on the Ambassador back office as well as through the rest of our websites. Hi there, it's Nick Vanderberg, uh, the CMO of VAR. Stop sharing. Um, good evening, everybody, and I hope that uh, helps to uh, answer any questions that uh, you might have had since yesterday's call. As I stated already at the beginning of this call, I am still collating questions related to the staking, the validation, uh, the APY returns on Yield Pro, as well as additional questions relating to the tokenization of assets and pertaining to some of the restricted markets based on that uh, premise. So make sure that you uh, stay tuned as I'm going to be updating this video that I have just uh, put together over the course of today. It is available as a Google share as well as then we're loading now um, the updated compensation plan elements into the back office. Further to that, what we're also doing is we were providing uh, video content related to um, the walkthroughs of the AML KYC process, as well as then uh, content related to Starvar onboarding, uh, Yield Pro onboarding, and also UltraFair onboarding. So that's happening um, over the course of the next uh, next few days. And as I said to you already, please, if you haven't uh, had any of your questions answered, I have been collating these during the course of yesterday evening as well as today. Make sure you pin those up to your upline so that I can then answer those and update uh, the content accordingly. Really grateful for your time. Thank you so much for um, sending in your questions. Hopefully this gave you a wider overview of the compensation plan and to answer any questions that were outstanding since yesterday's uh, webinar. Thank you again. Uh, uh, Sake token now released to you. Only I want okay. Um, stake to so uh, just regarding the stake tokenization. Sorry, there was a the question there. I'm just going to pick up on it now as it came through on the Q and A. Um, happy to happy to answer all those questions. We're just waiting on legal compliance. Uh, for the sign off on the answers to all those questions, which I am in the process of doing. So thank you very much for your time. Really appreciate it. And. Uh, Oh, sorry, please end for now your voice. Sound is going down. Sorry, Rev. <laughs> I don't know why I got a bit silence there. Just merely saying, just to cap it off, um, this video is available along with the video from yesterday. And I am going through the last part of the question pertaining to staking returns and such uh, related to Yield Pro, which I did get questions on, the tokenized event, the minting events, and uh, those types of questions, which I'm waiting for legal compliance sign off on. So I'll make those available as soon as I have them. And uh, furthermore, obviously, if there are any other additional questions to underline uh, yesterday's showcase on the updated compensation plan, as well as today's uh, detailed description of the various products and services and the VARA back office uh, overview, please let me know so that I can then address those. Thank you very much.